Hi. Uh, welcome back. Um, I am aware. Yes, I am aware there's no one watching me. And I am aware that I only probably will get like 50 views on this. And that's fine. Oh, God. Um, today, we are welcome, by the way, to another episode of Cozy with Morgs. Today, we're doing girly things. Um, I'm just going to get ready, probably, and I want to scroll through Pinterest. Two things at once. When the music's too loud, I can't concentrate. I want to go through Pinterest, and I hear that the 2013 Tumblr girl trend is back. I'm not here for it. I'm not here for it. But let's just look into that. Um, let's also just get lost in uh pinterest also okay <laughs> um a lot of things going on in the in the head right now i'm gonna get ready um and let's talk about for now anyways what i have coming up hopefully you can hear me okay i'm gonna move this a bit closer i don't know i feel like okay uh coming up we have um, my uh, 100 hobby series. We have some air dry clay. I'm so spacey right now. And uh, Emily Build, which I'm really excited for you guys to see. Um, I plan on filming something else today, which I'm also excited about. That one I'm going to... Should I just say what it is? No, I'm not going to say what it is. Um, but yeah, so if you're not already subscribed to my channel uh, while you're here, if you're stopping by, if you happen to just see this randomly, um, give me a... Just subscribe me, please. Subscribe me. Um, other than that, we're just going to get right into my day. I think I'm just going to start with my makeup my makeup routine so let's just plug this back in here um probably gonna look at myself under while i do this uh okay do you want to know my skincare routine um here it is this i got this okay this it's not good not good Come on, turn on. Um, it's not great. Okay, I have a feeling this audio is going to be ass. I think I got it. I think I got it as a stocking stuff for one year. But I don't really have skincare right now. I used to do uh, Ipsy, but... You know. I don't do that anymore because I'm just simply not going to spend money on that. Also, I started to accumulate a lot of shit from them that I didn't really use. Mmm. They did give really good skincare, though. That, I will say. Um, so, yeah. I'm really- I don't know where to put this. Oh, God. I could entertain myself for hours, I'm telling you. So I'll start with a little bit of this. I ideally would uh, have a bigger skincare routine. And I should. But, dude, I'm too cheap for that. Okay, I'm too cheap. So I use what I have. Okay. All right. What is it? What is it? What do they call it? Um relatable <laughs> whatever all right so a lot of the well, not a lot but this palette that i'm about to use i got for christmas dude i'm a makeup girly i don't care what anyone says i am a makeup girly i'm in front of a window so this natural light 
This is from, I want to say, I think this one is from London Drugs. I'm in Canada for anyone. Oh, shit. Sorry. Um, yeah, here in Canada, London Drugs. I love London Drugs. Uh, you know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of like a Morphe palette. Um, but honestly, I think this might, I would say this is very comparable to a Morphe palette. Um, you can, you can see the setup is pretty much the same. Uh, packaging is really cute. It's like kind of a foil. I see it gets kind of greasy. Um, it's really cute though. These glimmer sh uh, shadows here, very chunky. Um, I would say, I, I think it's cool. I think it's cool tone. But I also don't really know if I know the difference, but I think it's like partly cool toned and partly deeper warmer. I don't know. Color theory was not my thing. Um, but yeah, so uh, 35 shades in this palette from what it looks like. You might be able to take it apart. And if you're the kind of person that, you know, puts them individually in their own little cases, like some people will pull apart uh, the palette and take each individual one and have it in like a magnetic uh, case. Uh, I, I feel like you could probably do that with this, although the casing is really nice. Um, cruelty fee, Cru cruelty fee, cruelty free. Uh, uh, yeah, that's about it. So I'm going to start this, I guess we can go in with the K. I wanted to gate gatekeep this really bad. I really did. I don't know if I'm, I'm obviously not going to anymore. Um, but oh, come on. you know, I'm cheap, you know, I'm cheap girl. La Mercerie, that's called. I can't. Let me know if the audio is okay. I don't think it probably isn't. Fuck, I'm still trying to figure this out. God damn it. Uh, it's setting spray. It's matte finish. Um, I got it from Dollar Tree, okay? Dollar Tree. Tree. Not Rama. Tree. Okay, girl. Get into it. So, I see it, right? I'm checking out. I see it. And the lady's like, oh my gosh, we have this back in stock. And I'm like, I guess so. She's like, it's amazing. It works so good. I can't believe it. Like for a dollar store product, right? It's like $1.50. Um, I'm like, okay, slay. I didn't really, didn't have high hopes, but it's nice. I gotta say, I might just be gaslighting myself, but cause I don't, I don't really know makeup that well, but I feel like it works for me. Um, it kind of holds everything together. Although I have a feeling this is going to bite me in the ass once I start applying my, uh, foundation. Cause I think from what I remember the first time I tried this, mixing it with the foundation, I'm using, it's going to start to fall apart. But what this was really nice was for keeping it together. Also it's very sweat proof. I sweat a lot. Like I'm a, I'm a huge sweater. So um yeah so before i get too distracted because i feel like i'm gonna be kind of everywhere i'm just gonna pat that all in hmm what can we talk about today i see there's one person here who might this be say hi i guess i could probably just check but i'm not I'm looking at my uh, stream labs right now, and that's probably why I'm always looking here. I should probably maybe I should move this here. Um, January, what is it? January 9th. It's currently 9:57 a.m. Uh, here in British Columbia, Vancouver Island. Uh, it was snowing yesterday. It snowed for the first time. I was quite surprised. It didn't stay. It rained. It's all gone now. Which, hey, I'm not mad. I 
I will say it is kind of sad not having snow during Christmas if you're not like I'm from Saskatchewan, so you know, there's always snow on Christmas. Except for I think this year there wasn't. I'm not even gonna lie, okay? If you're in your 30s, maybe even if you're in your late 20s, you're gonna have whiskers. You will have whiskers. Don't, you're not fooling anyone. You have whiskers. So this, I bought <laughs> Timu a really long time ago, like in the summer, I think. Um, come on, turn on. Oh God, it's kind of lethal. Um, anyways, it's a little, it's kind of loud and vile, but it's like a little, it doesn't usually sound that aggressive. So getting rid of the old mustache, right? Uh, wait, why did I just do that? Oh, I'm doing that. Oh, my hair. Oh my God. Okay. Just be careful. <laughs> You get all the whiskeys off. Girl, okay, don't, don't, you have chin hairs. If you're 30, you have chin hairs. You honestly could probably use this like on your pits and stuff, but I'm not gonna, cause I just use it on my face, but oh yeah. Okay, well, hold on. I'm doing this just looking in the monitor. No, I'm not gonna do that. Sorry about that. Anyways. <laughs> so there's my chin hair shaper. 10 out of 10 will recommend. I think it was like fucking, sorry, language. Freaking $2 on Timu or something. I don't care what anyone says. I love Timu, okay? Um, this, I'm not going to do, I think. I'm, I've been scared. I've been scared. It's Lash Serum. This, I don't have autofocus on this. It's a webcam, so I don't have autofocus. Um, it's Eyelash Serum. Also from the dollar store. This one's from Dollarama, Bougie. I'm not going to use it, though, because I'm on. I'm kind of scared. I'm kind of scared. I don't, I've seen really bad reactions to serum, and I'm just, like, not. I don't know if I want to take the chance right now. Um. And go with my brows and I i'm just gonna, i need to calm down okay i need to calm the fuck down sorry when i get nervous i like just can't stop myself oh let's talk about what can we talk about today what is something create oh yeah no mm. No, I don't care. I was going to, you know what? I was going to gossip about like celebrity stuff, but I've just been thinking like, I mean, sometimes I'll talk about <laughs> Taylor Swift to uh, like, who doesn't, to Brody. And then I'll be like, and then I'll think like, what am I doing? Like that, is that creepy? Like, or rude? Just talk about someone like when they're not there. You know, like, you know, I'm just, like, thinking of in terms of, like, if they're just, like, a regular person. Come on. Um, so, I'm, like, is that creepy and rude? I feel like it is. So, like, I wouldn't do that to, like, well, what are I, I don't know. I guess gossip is gossip, but. My feedback on that one guy's jokes at the Golden Globes. Like everyone else, we had no idea who this guy is. We don't know who you are. I still don't know who you are. I just know that you, like, have deeply offended a lot of people. Not Maybe not deeply offended, like, okay, we'll get over it. But it's, like, it's embarrassing. Not even so much the Taylor Swift joke, but honestly, the Barbie joke about the Barbie movie. What did he say? Something like he like talked about plastic boobs and like something about plastic tits or something, and um, how he's attracted, to, how he's attracted to a doll, and how uh, it's not always about Margot Margot Robbie. It's like who's that fucking greasy man? Anyway, so I was like, um, 
and as I talk about that, I just feel like, who cares? Like, not like, who cares? Like, we care. I care. I just, I don't know. Just feels silly. Just feels like, why do we talk about that when we talk about global warming? We only have 13, and this is actually serious. We have, scientists say, 13, about 13 years to, to, be able to fix global warming before it starts to like happen. So, so <laughs> I'm so dumb, but you know what I mean? Like it just, we have, we don't have, we have one at a time. This guy was crying. Okay. The scientist, he was crying on the news and he's scared for his family, his daughter mainly because sorry to scare anyone with kids, but, like, we'll probably be fine. Us parents, I'm not a parent, but, like, you know, people our age may be possible. I don't know, during the end. But, like, they don't think they will. Like, I think they might see the end. So, 13 years. Let's just do what we can. I'm probably, like, I am mostly vegetarian right now. I'm trying to cut out dairy. That's really, dairy part's hard. Um, but I am trying to be mostly uh, sustainable in that way. I'm selling my car. Okay. I recycle everything. When I say everything, I mean, except for, like, garbage. And even, gar- okay, well, obviously, except for garbage, but, um, I just have, like, really immense guilt sometimes for the things that I'm throwing out. So, you know, like, using compostable bags is something that I do because even just things like putting plastic into the ground, if I have, like, right, I'm going to have to throw trash out. Put in compostable bags so that at least it disintegrates faster or you know plastics hard plastics soft plastics uh, fucking anything wrappers tin foil i mean unless it's disgusting with food on it and i absolutely have to throw in the garbage i will but i have bags and bags of bags of plastic like i'll rinse out like if something comes with food in a plastic bag and it's got like food residue i'll rinse it out i'll dry it and then i'll put it in a bag to take the recycling I just, I don't know. I'm scared, but I also know it's like kind of like, I don't know why, maybe nothing like this, but like voting, it's like, well, I don't know. It's like the theory of like, well, everyone else is voting. If one vote less won't hurt kind of thing. It's like, yeah, well, that one more vote could have been like a make or break situation. You know what I mean? So I just think, like, if we can all do our part, that's important. The climate's all fucked up everywhere around here. Um, they say we are due for, like, another world catastrophe or something. I don't really know. Don't really look too far into it. But I do know that... Um, I do know that that that's a fucking thing. So we need to just, sorry for my language. Honestly, I'm trying so hard not to like swear. I just, it's so kind of trashy, you know? It's like, same with like my pink hair. I got rid of my pink hair because like, no offense to anyone with colored hair. I just, on me, it just was like, not the luck. Also, I get profiled a lot. Like I have tattoos and I don't know, maybe I just like look sketchy, but I feel like I get profiled a lot, so. Yeah, it's just one of those things. Um, I'm just going to try to figure out why my chat box is not showing up anywhere. Hold on a second. Oh, yeah, here it is. Okay. Um, there you are. Uh, so, yeah, I don't know. Where can I put this chat box right there? Let's 
so it's scary but um just think about it you know what i mean like it does it is an actual pain like it's a it's not i don't know if it's a pain it's just time consuming um taking everything you know to the recycle depot and then sorting it or you know sorting it in general it takes a long time but i usually just sort it while i'm there like i throw in each container as i need and just put it all in one bag so i think storage is probably gonna be your main um your main inconvenience because you're gonna have to have bags and like we use those like re reusable bags from the grocery store um for ours and then we just take a haul out but it's just i don't know For the hassle, it, I think I, it just makes me feel better, you know? Um, I, I just, yeah, I don't know. I used to just not even think twice about what I threw away, like, at all. And, uh, yeah, I gotta be more, I think everyone should be more cautious about that, but. Okay, now that we're done the eyebrows, you can't, oh, sorry, I keep hitting this. Um, you can't really see, but they're on there a little bit better. I'm um, currently listening to low fi You can't really hear it though. Let me just see if I can turn this up. Um, yeah, so. It's 10.09 a.m. That's nice because I'm not really, I've been sleeping in a little bit too often. So, okay, let's, let's move on here to gloss. I think I'm going to do like a clean makeup look, I think. I am using the Jason Wu Lip Plumper Gloss. Uh... This gloss was, I think, about 20 bucks. Um, packaging had potential, uh, but the, I don't know what that is, the print on there just totally wiped off. Um, it sort of plumps. It's, like, not bad, but it's not great. Um... yeah i i probably would i uh, i think that there's probably cheaper out there um and i've already gone through so much but like doesn't really it's nice but it's not really effective <sighs> let's go on pinterest now and see if we can find some clean girl looks to go off of I was looking at millennial girl uh, fashion. So I'm like, what do I want to wear? <laughs> and I can't dress. Like, I'm not young anymore. So I'm just, well, I am young. And like, I don't know why I said that. But in the sense of like, I just feel like I can't pull off a lot of makeup anymore. I don't know. So we're going to try to just be au natch. Maybe this one? See, these girls are so young. Like, I don't think I could do it. I just don't think I could. Okay, it looks like it's just like, like, that's beautiful. Like, I don't know, something like that, I guess. Oops. Um, hmm. This is a homepage on my business account. And I have to say, it's, it's okay. Like, what are all these, like, government of BC ads? Oh, I wonder if I'll get 
copyrighted for that, probably. Okay, um, let's just, yeah, let's just see if we can find something else. Hmm. Also, change the song. If you guys want to know what I'm listening to on Spotify, this is it right there. Um, okay. Let's see, like, this girl's like, like, 11. I like this makeup, but I can never look like that. Like, how do they do that? I never even look like that. I don't know why I'm even trying. This is nice though, but it's just like mostly eyelash and I'm not doing those brows. <laughs> Let's see what it looks like when I do it. Like it won't even go up like that. Like, they're so big and bushy. I don't get it. I don't want a black. Definitely uneven, but that's okay. Okay, I guess we're just going to wing it. I really don't need I really don't need to look at a photo she's not really even wearing makeup so um okay so a lot of time I see them starting out with foundation and I'm like do we do that Here's the thing, I don't like foundation. <laughs> so maybe we'll just do like a little bit of like something. I am using <laughs> a Rare Beauty. I think my shade 30N. What do I have to say about this foundation? It's fairly lightweight, dries pretty fast. Um, it's I think it's made for more oily skin um, because it's very drying. Um, I have dry skin, so it's a little bit like, I don't know, if I'm not careful, it gets chalky. Um, so that's that in mind, I guess. I don't know. Uh, I used to love makeup. I still love makeup a lot, but I was like one of those girls that religiously watched, um, like Laura Lee, <laughs> Manny, Emmy Way. Um, those are the ones that stuck out. Nikki tutorials. Who else did I used to watch? Jeffree Star, obviously. Um, oh, there's that one girl, Kristen. Ugh, I can't remember her last name. Um, I think she lives in Canada. Um, oh my gosh, what's her name? I don't know, Kirsty. 
and she just had a baby not too long. Well, I guess it was a while ago now. I'm thinking of it. Um, anyways, I watched her a lot. <laughs> That's so, like, vague. Um, okay, so I'm gonna, sh I'm about to show you a lot of what I got from MC when I was using MC. Uh, so I'm just trying to go through it before I buy n new stuff. Uh, we got some translucent powder. Just, whatever. Oh my god. Uh, so I'm gonna... Oh god. My brush is kind of dirty, that's fine. <laughs> um, okay. Get that down. See, like, it looks, it looks nice. It's not, it doesn't really crease, which is good, but I think if I were to pick any foundation that I've used so far it probably would be NARS but it coming in at like 70 bucks I simply cannot afford that the one time I did buy it it was with a gift card and then same with this like once a year kind of thing it's amazing I'm always so happy when I get makeup gift cards as I got something I don't really think about either but and I'm like yay <laughs> so shout out to Brody's parents for that they're really really amazing uh, this Christmas it's never Christmas we really miss home like oh I always send Brody links to different places um, that are cheap <laughs> for rent um i mean we probably will never move back but it's well maybe event actually yes eventually we will well we will definitely eventually but i don't know about anytime soon um again this is another setting powder slash shimmer i don't know what this is saint lux saint lux saint lux oh my god i can't figure it out um it's a shimmery loose powder and I'm just putting that all over my face. Uh, uh, who was it? Oh, there's another beauty influencer that said to put, try putting powder on underneath first. And that really helped. Oh, what's her name? Crap. Oh, there's so many. I can't remember the names. Oh, I'm going to have to find her. She's so good. Makeup tutorial. Let's see. Oh, crap. It's like on the tip of my tongue. Once I see her, I'll know. Um, oh, gosh. It's all washed out now. Before I did this, and it would be all the best. Um, all the OGs. What? And maybe she doesn't make it anymore. But I just wouldn't even know how to, like, search for her. I was like... Makeup? I don't know. Uh, I'm trying to think of like an iconic thing that she did. My God. <laughs> Why? Hi. <laughs> no. That's cute. Oh, I'm really sad. I can't find it. Mm. <laughs> I want aesthetic videos.
there's so many people. I've never seen like hardly any of these people. I'm so out of touch. Like, Nikki's the only one left in the algorithm. <laughs> A lot of shorts, but I'm probably not being specific on what I'm asking. So, I mean, I don't know. I'm just going to go back. We continue. Maybe we'll do like a... little brown eyeliner. I don't know. Okay. Let's do like a little bit of bronzer on the lids. Do we have anything here we can use actually? This is very, I don't, again, I don't know if that's warm toned or cool toned. I think it's warm toned. But we're going to use some of that bronzer as eyeshadow and just kind of like swipe that everywhere. Just to like give a little bit of contour or something. And then we're going to bring the nodes in also. Something I want to learn how to do is contour my nose. I have no idea how to contour. Not a clue. Like, I mean, there's lots of tutorials, and I've tried before, but I'm really bad at it. I, it just ends up being crooked. Like, my nose is just crooked all the time, and I can't, and it just looks weird. Like, I just, I don't know. Maybe I just have to be more light-handed. I just want a skinny nose, okay? I'm not going to do that yet. Okay. Now to add shimmer or not to add shimmer. Let's just see what they have. I am going to go in, I think, with one of these lighter colors here. So probably like this one. I'm just super lightly brushing it. I just kind of want it to be like barely there. See what I'm saying? Yeah. You, I mean, you cannot tell. You can't tell. I can tell. Okay. And if I think if I go any more than this, it's not going to be clean girl makeup. Uh, so let's move forward. I saw this on TikTok trending and I've had this forever. It's a vintage lip liner. Someone got it down to like the freaking very bottom. And they're like, what is this? And it was like viral, but I gotta say, I do love this just to fill in the little Cupid's bow area. That really is like probably the only thing I do. Oh, it's like crazy. And then I'll just like subtly line the like that you could go oh fuck I guess I'm overlining now <laughs> I'm so shaky. 
I don't know. One abs. Does not look straight. I don't know what's going on. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and. Oh shit, doing the foundation. I should have done this last. I'm just gonna go ahead and gloss it now. I'm like, do I move this closer? I don't know. Oh, shit. Okay. I'm just getting closer. I don't know how to feel about it. It's whatever. It just like wants to do its own thing. Oh my god, what the fuck? This is a disaster. See, this is why I bangs because I have some weird parts in my head that don't like showing. So I'll just. Right. Why do I feel so chumpy? <laughs> I'm not editing this. I don't care. I just really shouldn't care. I kind of do. I shouldn't. Is this my angle? Maybe this is the angle. Maybe not, but we're in. Do I give up? No, I don't. <laughs> Fuck it, okay? I've had enough.
This makes me look insane. Wait, the lips look good. Okay. It's a bit better, isn't it? Okay, fuck. Let's give her, let's keep going here. My one single viewer, which is probably a bot, and that's okay. That is okay with me. I think I just effed up by screening the setting spray before it. Do you know what I mean? Like, oh, gosh. Like, I love this foundation, but it's really drying. And I probably could have gone for a shade darker. Oh, well. I'm going to get this on. It just, I mean, it is nice coverage. I'm not going to lie. But... Pasty I am. Oh, this is a nightmare, you guys. I'm so sorry. I don't even know where to put this, like. Alrighty, so done with that. Whoever's watching, do you want to give me a follow? Um, it's probably a bot, but it's worth the ask. <laughs> Watch it, it totally is a bot. I can't believe I've been on stream for almost an hour. That's crazy. I feel like I haven't really done anything. It's still nice and early in the morning, though, so that's good. Let's, I don't know, let's maybe try some contour. Um, I'm wondering, I'm going to put it on while my foundation's still not pressed in or not uh, finished or set, I guess. Let's turn the music up a little bit. I'm using 
Bronze Beauty by Real Heart. Uh, another Ipsy. Find who else will email. I focused on just this upper half. And once I have that about halfway down, then I'll start to just bring it straight down to accentuate my high cheekbone. Carve that out a little bit. So yeah, like I never contour, but if you do it right, it looks really good. I will say this foundation does make, because it dries away it does, it makes it really easy to blend in products. Um, even if you don't have it set with a powder yet. Um, so that's nice, but I would prefer to use cream contour. I just, I don't have any good cream contour. Oh, hi. Thanks for the follow. Have some faith. Well, that's awesome. Thank you so much. Welcome. Hi. It's going great. How's my audio? How are you? I'm just doing my makeup right now. Um, just girly things. The lighting is surprisingly decent. Um, usually it's raining where I, where I live, so it gets uh, pretty gloomy and then I can't really, uh, I can't really get good lighting for it. I do have shadow or softbox lighting, but I don't like to haul that out all the time just for makeup. Uh, so I'm loving the lighting today. How are you? Is that even? I can't tell. I'm just gonna go down to my neck. Um, my face looks a lot lighter than my body right now, but I don't think, like, I think it matches good. I just think it's the lighting that I'm in right now because the window is about stops about there, so I'm getting all the good lighting on my face, and then the rest is just regular, <laughs> whatever lighting. I will say clean girl makeup is something I've never really done before mostly because I my whole like adult slash <laughs> uh, young adult life I wore a lot of makeup well I, I guess not a lot but I got a signature look which was um winged liner when those who crash on is it was kind of like that um so never really gave clean girl makeup a try, but I think it might suit me. <laughs> Low key. I'm trying to get away from my like tattoo girl aesthetic. Like, okay, so here's the thing. 2013 is probably when I got 2013. No, maybe like 2010 is when I got a lot of my tattoos. 2011 maybe? No, wait. I don't even know. Maybe it's 2009. I don't know. It was a lot. Like, thinking I'm like, it was before college. and co I graduated college in 2013. Um, and I started college, I think, at the end of 2011. And it was before college that I got the majority of my tattoos. This is my last one that I got. The, the arm one. Um, so, yeah, I mean, thinking back on that, long time ago, I'm old. I'm not, I'm actually not that old. 
I'm in my 30s, 32, but still. Are you still here? Have some faith. <laughs> At least I had a chatter. I'm so excited about that. Usually it's just pretty quiet around here, so. I feel like my nose looks crooked now. Is it just the orientation? I can't. Don't play with me. <laughs> so here's the thing. I was going to maybe try freckles, but I don't really think... Oh, my eyeball. <sighs> so. Now, okay. So I think the only thing I don't have with me right now is highlighter. But I can just use that. Oh, no, I have some in here. I'm gonna go in with some lush slash highlighter. Oh no! Just broke. Where's that? Looks like this. It's a little bit shimmery and pink. It's cute. Uh, it's broken now though, so. Of makeup. It's so cute. Okay. I think we're almost done. Just me to highlight, I guess, and mascara. We're going to try highlighting the nose. I don't really do this a lot. We're going to try and see. Oh, and the inner corners. Are... taking some of that loose uh, shimmer powder and I am going in with that to the inner corners and just go in here
crooked. I can't. I think it's just the lighting, but. Let's see. Okay, it looks crooked. What did I do? What did I do? <laughs> Whatever. That looks so good. <laughs> I hope I don't get caught. Okay. I guess we can probably put the mascara on now, I guess. Use the combo here. Um, I think I might brighten my under eye too. I feel like I think this is wearing carpenter dresses. I need I need a fucking life, man. I'm I need a life. I think so. I, I say things out loud and then I instantly am like. overstimulated. This is what happens when I got makeup on. I instantly become like, feel gross. Okay, I think this is my new look. Slay. Okay, she said, oh, nah, girl, I don't know about that one, but we're going to add some, just a little bit of something just to deepen up the under eye, you know, that we have that. Um, cream color on there. I think I'm gonna spray myself down before I go ahead with the mascara. So again, I'm just taking my Dollar Tree spray. It's a matte finish. I'm not particular about the finishes. I probably will do a matte finish if I'm gonna be in public because I sweat a lot. Like a lot, like I get anxiety sweat. So I'm not going in public, but I am just chilling. <laughs> Who cares, right? Like, okay. Yeah, so I think maybe just like let's touch base on New Year's resolutions. Um my one one of them one of the big ones would be to swear less, um, cuss less. I would love to cut it out altogether. Um, it's just not becoming, and if I use it, I want to use it, like, so often. Yeah, I don't know, I just, not, I mean, whatever, to each their own, but I just feel like I do a lot of unnecessary swearing, and I, I want to be con cautious about, like, who's watching, and... I'm sharing this with and how I come off so 
that's something really important. Um, we're almost done with our makeup, so let me... Wow, I have the gift of gab, don't I? Let me just show you what I'm putting on right now. Uh, wet and Wild to make wear. And then Ioni. Um, this Ioni stuff is really good. Ioni, across the board, I am like quite impressed with. Um, it started... I've, I've seen it really only at the dollar store. Uh, dollar Tree. And every time I go there for anything, it's... A lot of it's sold out. Um, it's a really good rent. For, for the price point, it's great. So I'm going to start off with this. I think if needed afterwards, I'll add maybe like a little bit of something at the end, but. You know, I didn't realize how good clean makeup looks on me. Period. I think as you get older, um, less, less sometimes is more. I'm at an age right now where I'm like, should be in my prime. And I think I am. Like, I'm, I mean, I could maybe lose a little bit of weight, but I mean, that's neither here or there because I feel like I'm kind of healthy now. So, um, not that I, I mean, I was pretty unhealthy before, but mostly mentally and, um, like physically the weight was never an issue. I mean, whatever, but I'm, I'm just... I mean, maybe I'm just fine the way I am. I shouldn't even think about that. Who cares? I think I'm beautiful. Wait, it's not. I'm so, like, as a woman, uh, brainwashed to think that I have to, like, be thinner to look better. But it's not, that's not the case. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I guess be easier to yourselves. Um, in 2024. Forgot to use, uh, curling lash curler. So I'm going to wait for this to dry a little bit and then I'm going to do that. Probably don't curl your lashes when, you, oh no. But when you have mascara on, but I'm going to. So do what I say, not what I do. that little mark there so they're probably not dry enough but we're just gonna go in <laughs> what should I have for lunch today I don't know and am I going to post this on YouTube? I prep, I don't know. We'll see. Um, so that's it. Maybe I'll stand up so you can have better lighting. The lip turned out really nice. Like I said, I think... Is it just my face? Like, I swear I made my nose look crooked. See, this is why I don't... Like, I think maybe it's just the... Angle? I don't know. <laughs> anyway. I'm just gonna pack this on. <laughs> hey, you know what? I got one follower this whole stream. That is awesome. Um, so that's fun. I'm on the path to 50 followers. 
So, if you're re-watching this, welcome. Again, my name's Morgan. I I have been streaming pretty regularly. Um, Usually about once a week. Maybe more, depending on what I have on my workload. Uh, So, I'd love to give me a follow. I also upload somewhat consistently uh starting february i will be uploading i want to say every week at least um i have a series coming out called 100 hobbies uh pretty self-explanatory i will be trying 100 hobbies uh mostly crafts uh but i'm open to suggestions Uh, Thanks for tuning in. I think I'm going to head out. Uh, You can follow me on my other socials. It's Cozy with Morgan everywhere across the board. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, Thank you. Have some faith (laughs) for saying hi. Um, That bot, well, you gave me a view, so thank you. Anyways, we'll talk to you guys later. Have a good one. Bye.